I just want to say a few words on a publication that we've done on uh, inequalities uh, because we are, are not all equal in the face of the pandemic. Uh, we have published and analyzed the data for, the data for Montreal, and we're seeing that uh, in the neighborhoods uh, that are less uh, are 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 defavorized or uh, are poor, we have 2.5 times more people with COVID-19, and this gap has been wider and wider during the pandemic. is getting wider and wider, and we know that. This can be explained by many factors. Of course, uh, the uh, poverty conditions, uh, more chronic diseases, people living in small apartments, difficulty in uh, the application of the uh, public health measures, and of course, uh, people that in those neighborhoods who have been essential workers uh, uh, more exposed to the virus during the, the peak of the pandemic. Uh, and I think we have to uh, be uh, reconnaissant or say thanks to them because uh, uh, they have uh, made, uh, they, 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 they make sure, they made sure that we add services during the pandemic. Uh, we're working on uh, strategies to make sure to reduce this gap in those inequalities facing the pandemic. Uh, and we have different uh, strategy put, put in place. Of course, we want to make sure that we still give access to those populations to test. Uh, that our services, our messages are well adapted to make to reach them. Uh, we want to make sure that uh, the uh, intervention that we have done in um, logement multiplex in the uh, apartment buildings uh, to reduce the uh, the risk of transmission are still there and will still be increased. We have uh, there has been. Uh, uh, we have we are, we will be seeing uh, different projects in some community with community organizations to reach those population, but also to help uh, population that have difficulty in uh, getting be staying isolated during uh, and applying the the public health measures. And uh, we uh, are working with different uh, with the city to make sure that in those neighborhoods we have uh, public spaces that uh, facilitate distanciations. 